Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey, and I'm back with some more Dragalia Lost. Today's video, very simple, just gonna be grinding Loyalty's Requiem. Yeah, easy, right? Um, as you can see here, wow, I actually got a key? That was easier than I thought. Um, start with Nightmare, go down to the other ones. I just need, really need to start grinding this event a little bit. Uh, and that's basically it, so. Let's down, get down to it. This is the first time I've played it since, um, Honestly, yesterday. <laughs> I just mean it's been a very long time since it's return. That's what I should have said better. Man, I can't believe this was the first event in Dragalia. Feels like forever since then, man. I also can't believe, um, how much has changed since then. It's kind of crazy to think about, honestly. Um, yeah, weird. Ugh. I'm sorry, I'm tired from recording a lot and talking to some friends. It's good, that was, that was actually very nice. Um, that I was actually able to talk to some friends today. You kind of forget in the quarantine how much talking to friends is, and it's been a very long time since I last talked to mine, so... It was nice to kind of get that feeling and feel normal. As normal as you can be in the current situation that we got. Uh, that is. Mm. Still using this dude here with his King Ghidorah heads. I love him for it. Don't care if he says they're tentacles. But they're King Ghidorah heads. Also learned apparently Tiki can frostbite, so that's cool. I didn't. I forgot that Tiki was a frostbiter. I only saw her as like an attacker. So tentacle phantasma. Pretty sure you're supposed to attack the tail, but we're so powerful now that people are kind of disregarding what you're supposed to do. Which is fine for right now. Um, when we actually get to the legit boss in Omega, maybe I'll care a little bit more. But right now it doesn't really matter. It's fine. I'm ignoring these volcanoes that are slowly reaching my death. Because he's easy enough to beat. But yeah, like I was saying, talking to friends was very nice. Oh. Got to tell him how good I've been doing in videos. It's nice. Thank you everyone who's watching this, by the way, who supports me and my Dragalia stuff. It's very nice. I appreciate it all. I never thought that I would one day uh, be able to make Dragalia videos that would be watched by more people that are subscribed to me. It's actually a very nice feeling. So, if you're watching this video, I know you're hardcore, because not everyone would... Um, watch this kind of video from me. Do I have any in here? No. Uh, not a lot of people will watch this kind of video from me because you know they're usually here for the hot um, brand new stuff and they don't really stick around for stuff like this. So if you're here watching this, thanks man. I appreciate it. And I especially appreciate anyone who also goes out and sees some of my other stuff. That's also nice of you. Alright, let's get going Alex. Come on. You could solo this entire thing by yourself. We don't need a Tiki to ready up. Ridiculous. <sighs> Let's get back into it. Is this gonna be on auto? Mm. Let's find out. It's to totally on auto. Play. Okay. Like Don't have to worry about anything. Okay. He's dead. Man. Dead, huh? To be fair, I'm pretty sure the other person is just using their shadow team, so that's why he died. He died so quickly. It's crazy to think about how much has changed, because even back in the day, beating him on standard was such a hassle. It was such a pain. On expert, I should say. Um, it was such a pain in the butt to actually beat him. It, was, it felt impossible for me when I was a brand new starting out. Um, people were, like, using... Um, like green characters to fight like a bunch of things to be fair i did just mention off type and someone was using shadow but that's different shadow shadow back in year one was a joke there was no good shadow units for a very long time i would say until maybe maybe yasu and then verica and then galacleo completely destroyed decimated what we know shadow at least that's how i remember it with a spear it's crazy, man. Now look at it. There's like 27 different good shadow units on any given day. Hell, Forte, who just recently got released, is fan-fucking-tastic. 
she's like I think top three in terms of raw DPS. And even even I'm like getting to the point where I'm like I don't know, it's a shadow unit, so of course it's gonna be good. Um, it's the Dragalia doesn't know how to not make a good shadow unit nowadays. Now they just kind of reserve it for um, water units. Ah, that's harsh. I like these water units. I think they're balanced and fun. So that's what I feel about that. Our attacks are working. Whack. 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 When the death animation is longer. My power is splendid now. My power is splendid now. My dog is barking now. Ooh, I would drive Punisher. Don't really need it, but thanks. No gems. Boo hoo. I only switched to EX because I thought it would be a little bit harder, but it wasn't, so. Back to this, and back to, I guess, just autoing it from here on out. Yeah, man. Much has changed. I will show you the fruits of my research. Who knew? It was real touching, though, though, at the beginning. The banner stuff, I'm really glad that Dragalia was able to look deep inside, see that people were unhappy with Prince being in banners. I think, in general, what they did with Prince was fantastic. Because um, taking them off the banner completely changed how you played Dragalia. I feel like back in the day, you just wouldn't care about Prince at all, because it was impossible to actually get fully working prints or a specific prints of anything. Nowadays, you have all prints available to you and the possibilities are like endless about what kind of team you could make. Like entire units, I think, end up getting better because they end up releasing a print that works fantastic with them. Uh, or they, the prints long thought dead end up being like really good, like the old Valentine's Day Burning Punisher print. Um, when it was released, it was like, eh, it's a burning whatever, it's a free-to-play one, I'll get it. And nowadays, it's like, oh no, if you're running bro anyone who causes burn, then you're running this print as well. It's crazy to think about, man. Here's one thing that has not changed. Everyone still runs original Ellie. <laughs> that was true back then, it's true now. People still just run Ellie. Oh, I think this might actually be Gala Ellie now that I look at it. Let me look. Yeah, it's Gala Ellie. People, Cerise, oh, I want Jinx so much. I wish I had her. I hope to pull her one day. What ingredients do you have there? Oh, hello. What team do you got, sir? Hunting buddies! Yay! Powerful. Everyone has Hunter Cerise but me and their team. I have Hunter Cerise. I'm just not using her. Mainly because I don't like how the um, AI controls with her. I think the AI doesn't know how to play Hunter Cerise very well at all. Um, I actually think she's more of a liability than a help on auto. She force strikes, but she doesn't move with force striking at all. She doesn't seem to know the ability to. His back is like a volcano, and it's also dead. Bye. Mama, it's up to you. Keep it up. Before me. My power is splendid now. My power is splendid now. This man, so greedy. He's just too beautiful for his own cause, I think. Seven seconds, and that's not my world record, okay. I mean, that's how kind of how these go anyway. Especially if you have a good team build going into them. I will show you. The you just end up so crazy powerful that by the end you're just like stomping through everything, completely death, de devastating cities. You're unstoppable, so to say. Loading. One heck of a it's back is like a volcano! It's back is like a volcano! Transform, and it should be dead now. Oh, really? We got slow, man. We're s Our attacks are working. That's Let's 10 seconds, down. man. We slow down by three whole seconds. My Fear power is splendid. I think that's it for grinding. Let's see. Yeah. 
hope to eventually unlock um, Omega mode and actually have <laughs> the strong version of this fight, but for now I have to grind my way to it. I also get all these summon tickets too. Ooh. That, that's why I like these kind of, kind of events is because I get to have all my stuff back basically that I spent. I'm bringing pretty close to it, ticket-wise, I think. The fate of the world I'll rests get there. in our hands. That's the end of today's video, everyone. I hope you liked it. I'll see you guys in the next one. Enjoy your day out there, everyone. Bye-bye.